Worried that the little girl would be lonely without her companion, Kitsune Saigu decided to ask another member of her kin to keep the little girl company for a few days. I was the one she asked. Well, obviously, being the fabulously beautiful fox that I am, it wasn't long before the little girl was crazy about me. Not only would she buy me all sorts of tasty treats to eat, she would pamper me day in and day out. If it's no trouble, I'd really appreciate it if you could watch my performance and give me your suggestions. Thank you. Um, please don't laugh at me if there are parts that still need practicing. Oh, if you laughed at me, there'd be nowhere I could run from my embarrassment. A few days ago, I found an oddly colored berry during an adventure. It was really sweet, but at first, there were a lot of colored lights, but then it felt like a lot of little people were dancing in my head. I recovered quickly enough, but I regret not putting some in my bag. I wanted to warn everyone to avoid eating that type of berry. Since I'm a genuine knight of Favonius, I fulfill my duties like any other self-respecting individual would. Look, I may be a descendant of a disgraced ruling elite, but I'm not a total degenerate. Let me make this clear. If you're looking to confess, you should go find someone else. <laughs> So I was on duty this one time, receiving confessions from believers. And it was hard enough to make sense of their jumbled confessions. But then I had to use useless words like, may the Animo Archon bless you to make them feel better. Ugh, Archons have mercy on me. My hobby, I would say my job. Hmm? Some people treat work as a hobby, you say. Ugh, goodness me, very exceptional. <laughs> <laughs>